I want to be able to play my Brilliant Bridge, but I don't think that's going to happen. So, oh, well-performed, uh, well-thrown sticks. So we're going to do that, give him minus one. That's all on my energy, so I guess we'll, I'll end my turn here. Hello everyone, Time to Grind here, and uh, we are playing games on the Steam Next Fest, and I wanted to check out Battle Bands, and it's like a rock and roll deck builder of some sort, so it has a demo out that we're checking out here, uh, and it wants us to jump into a tutorial, so we're going to go ahead and jump into uh, the tutorial and see how it works. So, welcome to Battle Bands, in this tutorial you'll learn the basics required to get up and running with your band. Every battle band matches between two bands, this is your band, this is the opposing band, every band has a guitarist, drummer, bass, Assist and keyboardist, uh, each with their own unique deck. In each match, the bands play cards to generate hype. The first band to reach the goal hype wins. Hype is gained by playing performance cards like this one. So the ones, so I guess the the rock and roll symbol is what gives you hype. Okay. Most cards cost energy to play. Each bandmate has their own energy. When your energy is gone, you can only play cards with zero cost. Hey, Ryan, how are you doing? Interested? Yeah, I'm. I'm very interested in this one. All performance cards must be played on top of a song selection card. Double click the spicy verse card to play it. This will start playing a song. Your band now has an active song section. Now play a performance card to generate some hype. Oh, bassist. Ba I don't know why I always want to say bassist. Bassist. Gotcha. Okay, so now we, we play one of these. Uh, well, this seems to be the best one. So, loud rift. Notice your band's hype this turn is below the meter. It will be added to the meter at the end of the turn. Oops, uh, you're all out of energy. Unfortunately, it isn't all up. You're in a band. Awesome, the blast player came through the performance card. This also completed, or bassist. Uh, bass player uh, came through the performance card. This also completed the song selection. When a song section has reached its capacity, oh, so it, it took two. So it's completely kill, uh, filled. As a bonus for completing a song, you generate additional hype. We're going to need another song section to play more performance cards. The keyboard player played a... And I think this game is multiplayer, too. Like, so, that's interesting. Uh, the active jazzy hook song section has capacity for two more performance cards, but we don't have energy left to play our quick riffs. Some cards have special abilities. The drummer played a card that gave me uh, energy. Uh, so we're going to uh, play a quick rift. Once everyone in your band is done playing cards, it's time for you to end your turn. At the end of every turn, you muck cards in your hand and then draw fresh cards from the draw pile. Let's see the other band's turn now. Let's see how they do. Huh. This is interesting. I'm interested in how unique the cards are because the way this game is presented... I could see a lot of the cards being basic and simple, but I'm assuming that's not the, uh, the, the, the way. This actually looks like it could be really fun. Not my type of game personally. Definitely a fun idea. Yeah. I think the whole, like, this, this is like multiplayer. So you can like, ha it's almost like Across the Obelisk. I have a whole Let's Play series on Across the Obelisk. So you used cards to make music. I think so. I think so. I don't know if it's actually changing the actual music, but, uh, crew are special cards that stick around through the match you have an acquaintance play it now so we got an acquaintance here guitar crew it's free plus one uh energy while in play every two turns so we have that let's play some performance cards and generate some hype okay so we don't have a new song we can play but oh there's already a song here so uh sick rift our drum player paid something uh well all, all these are now effectively the exact same speed rift speed rift oh yeah they literally are the same if the cards don't have an actual impact on the music playing, I feel like that's a massive oversight. Yeah, we'll have to, uh, no song section. Maybe it's, I don't know. Yeah, we'll have to, we'll definitely have to see. Let's play some performance cards. There are times when your best option is to give energy to a bandmate. Right now you have no cards, but you do have one energy. Use the give button to pass energy uh, to a bandmate. So we'll give, select a bandmate. Um, I don't know, we'll give it to our drummer. We gave Cameron some energy. Your bandmate played a Hurl Insult card. This card doesn't give your band hype. Oh, it reduces the other band's hype. Okay, okay. Once everyone in your band, uh, protection shields your band from negative 
effects. Your bandmate played a card that provides protection. Okay. Okay, I'm starting to see. I'm starting to see this now. So now it's their turn. They played a Hurl Insult card, but we had a protection on it. Okay. Is, is, okay. I guess they're just not playing it all at once, because they're probably playing it like a actual team that we're facing would play. Pause for water. Sick beat. Okay, okay, so they, they got some of that. Nice, you have drawn a power cord. This will disrupt the other band while generating hype. Ends other band's song section on play. Oh, so they're, they're currently trying to do the catchy chorus. We're going to play that, and it just canceled out what they were doing. Um, oh, so well-practiced chorus. So we probably want to cont- Oh, it's, it's real time. Is this real time? Oh. So now I'm going to play a song there. Once everyone in your band is done playing cards, it's time to end your turn. That is interesting. That's interesting that it's real time, actually. I like that. I like that. Because I'm kind of comparing comparing this to Across the Obelisk. Because I'm going to try to get my Across the Obelisk crew uh, that we've been filming our Let's Plays for um, to check out this game when it comes out. Which, by the way, shill shilling, if you haven't watched our Let's Play series on Across the Obelisk, you definitely want to watch that um, over on YouTube. Uh, we're actually trying to film more tomorrow. It's been a while since we played Obelisk. Uh, it's the other band's turn, so... I guess we're just waiting for them to... Okay, there we go. So there's their hype meter. Playing cards allows them to be... Uh... Upgraded upgrades have oh wait playing cards allows them to be upgraded uh, Upgrades of various benefits and lasts a whole run. Oh Oh, it does what freaking what's that game? Um, Griftlands where the more you play the cards the more they upgrade that's sick That's sick. Okay, so you know what we're gonna play that because that's an easy upgrade one Some of these are harder than others uh, Sick. Oh, we don't have any I don't have any songs, so I'm going to go ahead and give my energy to my drummer. I don't know who I should be giving it to. Uh, getting the band back together, as it were. Exactly. Uh, well, do you do Across the Obelisk and one big recording block to break up or an uh, episode per recording? Um, we pretty much do, because it's hard to match up our schedules, we try to record like three or four hours at one time. Um, and kind of, you know, take breaks in the middle of it and stuff. I definitely want to record larger episodes this time. Um, since Obelisk is unfortunately not one of the most popular series, uh, things on our series, uh, popular series. So I want to, you know, it's what I try to do. Once everyone in your band is done playing cards. Oh yeah, end my turn. Kind of, oh. Oh wait, these were all free. Now that, oh, okay, nice. I gave the drummer something actually to do, so. Okay, so we ended our turn. I think we're going to win here. You have earned enough hype to win the match. However, your band went first, so the other band gets one turn to try to catch up. Makes fair. That's fair. Uh, I do know across the obelisk, the next big update is going to add a mode where it's like a random campaign that only asks, lasts like an hour or two um, versus like a whole long actual campaign. And so I think we want to try to get one more run done where we unlock the new character. And then at that point, maybe we'll just, you know, occasionally record some of those because that could be fun. That's what I feel like the play is, because getting four people with adult lives together for any period of time is hard. Yeah, no, we have a whole Google calendar where when we all commit, we are like, okay, I put put the time in the calendar. Uh, so we, we, we got no excuse. Okay, there we go. So that that's the tutorial here. Nicely played. You're now ready to get out there, start a band, and take on the world here. Okay, okay. Um, view your decks here. So there's like whole entire decks unlocked at level five. So you're unlocking a bunch of things here. I unlocked new next cards unlocks. Ask me about the three separate D&D campaigns I started that only went for two sessions. Yeah, I have not been able to uh, get into D&D. Like, I love Pathfinder 2.0. All my friends play it. But, um, yeah. That's, uh, it's hard. So can you customize your deck? I think you can, yeah. So apparently... 
there's going to be two modes. There's going to be a tour mode, jump in your van and battle your way through Rift City in a roguelike campaign, almost like uh, across the obelisk. And then Royale mode in the full game, you'll be able to go head to head against 63 other bands in huge online tournaments. That sounds awesome. Okay, so what's our band name here? Um, and also, if any of you guys want to uh, play right now and try it out with me, um, you guys could you guys could come join in the band if, if you guys want to. We'll probably be playing for like, you know, 30 more minutes or something. But okay, band name. Uh the The Grind the Grindsters. I don't know. Uh that's that's lame. Uh the 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 Grind Time I don't know. Gr grind time. Grind time. May have it downloaded already? Okay, we will definitely get you here in our uh in our band here. Um, okay, let me let me kick out. Okay, invite friends. Let's find Hatchet Daddy here. Uh, oh, there we go. Now it's doing it. Okay. I think I invited you. Tech builders are new to me, though, just so you know. Yeah, no problem. We're just testing out the demo here. Um, so who do I want to be? I want to be... I want to be the drummer. I want to be the drummer. Yeah, so I'm going to be the drummer... Um, always a classic. Oh, we can have, a, oh, we can customize our van. Okay, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna have the wizard, the wizard van. And I like the colors. Have you already done spider heck? It's really fun, especially with local multiplayer since there's friendly fire. Yeah, we, the, the game we played last was a uh, spider heck. And that was, that was a freaking blast, honestly. For some reason, it sent that invite like 80 times. Oh, yikes. Maybe I sent you too many. I don't know. So, okay, though. So, I'm the drummer. We have Hatchet Daddy as our bassist. Bassist, yeah. And then we're going to have bots for our keyboard and our guitarist here. So, okay. Let's let's freaking do this. Let's do this. This is this is exciting. I don't know. Multi, like, multiplayer deck building roguelikes are my new my new favorite gimmick that's been happening here that that's my new that's my new favorite gimmick thing that's been happening so welcome to tour mode so we have morale moving one space costs one morale if you run out of morale your run will end you can gain more morale by winning matches but if you lose the match you lose morale you use money to buy new gear and stuff like that a match is where you go to play against an opponent a moment you go here to trigger a random event you have a shop uh, to buy gear and cards or to remove cards. You can click your deck at any point. And then the final arena. This final show isn't available in the demo. Entering will end your tour. Explore the rest of Rift City first. So it's just a demo. We can't go to like the final boss. Um, so where's our van? We're right here. Okay, let's uh, let's go to an event here. So we lost morale. Okay, sponsorship offer. Sign money. Life is deal. Uh, we win 150. Band gets one obvious endorsement and a subtle endorsement. Wary of selling out. What are these cards? Can I see? Oh, minus 10 bands money on muck. Oh, so we're going to gain a bunch of money, but it's... Oh, you know what? Let's just get a little bit of money. Let's be a little wary of selling out. And Oh, and I guess Hatchet Daddy uh, can vote on whatever he wants. So I guess because I'm the host, all the bots vote with me. Um, but everyone gets to kind of vote in their own different way. So, okay, we got we got some money. So let's go to a... Let's go to a we can't go there, so we're going to... Oh, now it's Hatchet's daddy. Hatchet Daddy's turn to uh, drive the van. So I guess we take turns uh, driving. So you can go anywhere. I'm assuming you probably want to go to one of these spots here. Um, okay, so now we'll go here. And okay, so we got we got an actual an actual match here. Oh, okay, we get to we get to choose new cards. Okay, minus two to other bands. Um, so we're going to hurt them here with a clever dig or well-thrown sticks. Um, minus, oh, so green cards are only the drum performance. I guess you also have common that anyone could have. Uh, minus one other bands on play or moves other bands crew crew cards on play. That seems really good. I'm going to take that. Oh, oh, okay. I can choose for the bots. Uh, yeah, I want, I want the bot to have a protection for us. As I'm clicking them, it's not, it's kind of taking a little bit long to... I'm, oh, I'm having a double click. Okay. Um, plus one embarrassed to random opponents draw pot. You know what? Let's just get, uh, yeah, no, that's pretty good. Okay. Okay. Let's try this out. Grind time versus the scrap Titan. Did you know Nickelodeon's releasing a smash style game? Yes, I do. Wait, it, it's in the fifth. It's coming out in three days. 
I checked it out on Steam and it didn't have a release date. I am definitely gonna play it because I'm a huge Smash uh, fan. So okay, okay. So we got we got we got to do something. Uh, plus one bandmates energy on played. So I just gave Hatchet Daddy some extra energy here. Um, I have a song here. Okay, I'll play a song there so we can start playing in that. Um, the hurl insults isn't actually helpful because I don't think they can get into the oh they can get into the negatives. Nice. Okay, and I don't have any more energy I can play. I don't have any songs, so I'm gonna. Yeah, no, that's that's all I can do. So I'll just end my turn here. Oh, and we actually have a timer. You can see the timer. That is interesting. So now it's our turn. I guess this is just the campaign, so it's just the Scrap Titan. Oh, minus one max energy for us. It's got a lot of things that are exhausting. No, yeah, I'm really excited for that Nickelodeon game, because that game is made by the people that made, um... Slap City, which is fire. It's coming out the same time as the Smash Brothers Direct. That's actually hilarious. Okay, um, I don't want to play the Subtle Endorsement. Um, drums performance. We're going to do some... Oh, no song selection. I don't have a song selection. Does anyone have... There we go. Okay, sweet. So someone's going to play that. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just do that, and then we'll end my turn here. People are blasting music down the road for a communion or something, so rip my sleep. Oh, man. Hey, at least you could you could jam out. Uh, <laughs> you can jam out uh, to this. I, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> minus one max energy for you. Plus one on play. Is that giving him minus one max energy? I think it's giving him minus energy. Plus one to your defense. They're probably doing it on purpose. Pro probably, maybe. I really want the new Smash Fighter to be Hollow Knight. That'd be pretty sick. Uh, oh, he gave us broken things. Okay, um, brilliant bridge. Oh, never mind. Okay, we don't want to end the song. Oh, geez. Okay, 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 okay. We got a bunch of drummy songs here. Um, okay. I'll, I'll complete that. Can, can anyone else complete that? Maybe? No? Oh, come on. How? I want to be able to play my brilliant bridge, but I don't think that's going to happen. So, oh, well-performed, uh, well-thrown sticks. So we're gonna do that, give him minus one. That's all on my energy, so I guess we'll, I'll end my turn here. I guess this is not what I was expecting this game to be like, but, um, it's very interesting. It's very interesting. I'm also very interested in the, like, 64-player multiplayer thing. Because that could be very, very fun. I'm, I really wish roguelikes did more... Uh, multiplayer stuff like what monster train. Okay, where's my where's my um? Oh man, uh, hurl insults. Yeah, I guess we'll hurl some insults. Uh, I got a loud beat here. I don't have a song that I can do. Someone did a song. Okay, we'll do a loud beat. That's all I can do. Huh? Okay. This is very interesting. Obviously, we don't have very many unique cards right now. Also, I just realized that me and Hatchet Daddy literally are the same character. I don't know what that is about. <laughs> and I do like that you can uh, look you can look at your cards. You can look at your cards while they're doing their turn. Um, oh, he okay. So they made uh, Hatchet Daddy discard a card. Minus one, plus one broken things to random opponent's hand. Like I like these interactions with each other. What's your favorite roguelite, roguelike game? Well, if you count rounds, rounds is probably one of my favorite right now. Binding of Isaac is always one of my favorites. Um, Slay the Spire. Uh, okay, there we go. There's my brilliant bridge. And then we're going to quick beats. That's all we can really do. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, pretty much anything I've ever covered for multiple episodes on my channel. Um, I really like, like, deck building ones. I'm really excited about... Uh, this game called Despots game that comes out recently, or comes out soon. That's like an auto chess roguelike. Uh, but yeah. TTG's <laughs> Twitch is just a nice place to chill. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Even when we don't have like an absurd amount of people in here watching, I, I just appreciate because like these are going to get turned into videos. So it's nice to just be able to kind of chill out and hang out and be able to talk with you guys a little bit more. This is one of the best communities that I've ever been a part of. Oh man, you guys are you guys make me so happy. 
Okay, so what do we want here? Uh, well thrown sticks. Um, you know what? We're gonna get another well thrown sticks, and then I guess I choose for the bots. I just want to get the bot to protect us. Um, speedy rift. That's good because that's just free. Stop sucking up. <laughs> that's my job. <laughs> okay, so now it's hatchet hatchet daddy's uh, turn um, to go. So it'll be interesting to see where he where he goes. He's currently our our driver here. Okay, we're going to our next battle here. We're going to our next battle. Okay, um, new card. Plus one random bandmates. Energy on play. First draw. That's good. Starting drums. So that's that's cool. Um, sick keys. That's really good. Hurl insults. That's just a free card. So might as well. What are you doing for Halloween? Are you dressing up? I think we're our friend is doing a, um, a Halloween party where we're all having to dress up as a different like Greek gods and stuff. So I'm gonna try to dress up as a. Uh... Okay, I'm just doing starting drums. I'm gonna give two. I get, mainly gave it to my my bot. That's good. I just give someone else some energy, some starting uh, taps. Um, but to, yeah, so I think I'm going to go as Zeus, and I think my girlfriend's going to go as whoever was married to Zeus or whatever. I don't know. Hey, Dad Flap. <laughs> How are you doing? Did I miss the milk reveal? There has not been a milk <laughs> milk reveal uh, yet. We, we've just uh, we've been checking out this a uh, lot of different things, but mainly this uh, deck building roguelike thing. Hera was married to Zeus. Okay, I think it was Hera. Yeah, I think Hera is is, is who my girlfriend's uh, uh, gonna dress up as. So that, that's what that's what we're doing. But no, yeah, Dad Flap, everyone. Uh, if you guys enjoy the the reviews that are happening on the uh, channel, um, you can you can you can thank uh, you can thank. Uh, Dad flat for those for helping edit those. Otherwise, those would not that those would not be happening. Um, okay. Uh, plus, yeah, I think we just want to do. Oh, there's no song. Okay, can someone play a song? Does anyone have a song? No one have a song. Okay, I have a song, so I guess I'll play that. We'll exhaust one. That's all I can do. I only have two energy, so I don't have uh, that much. Being nice isn't sucking up. <laughs> I I know what you meant, but it's a Twitch chat. Yeah, I don't think anyone's uh. Yeah, no, we're this, we're, this is, this is, oh, 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 dang, okay, he gave me some, okay, oh, we have well thrown. oh, we don't have a song, I don't have a song, yeah, I do not have a song I can play, so I'm gonna try to give this energy to him, maybe, or our, our uh, guitarist or whatever, maybe, nope, okay, I'm assuming the bot, I'm assuming they would give the mana to each other, um, <laughs> Also, we're losing money every now and then because of that uh, record deal we took or whatever. Oh, hurt feelings. So yeah, they're 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 doing minus three to other. Oh man, they're hurting us. Rose to fit in your bandmates draw one on play plus one hurt feelings to a random opponent's hand, minus one to the other. Man, they're doing. This is interesting. The interaction between the uh, the decks and stuff. So okay, what are we doing? Okay. Uh, oh no, he they already played a song. Um, I, oh, okay, you know what? Quick beat. I want to upgrade quick beat. So quick beat should be upgraded now. Okay, finish it. I'm going to do my brilliant bridge here. My brilliant bridge there. And that's all I can do. I don't have any energy. You know what? I really like this, actually. Because, like, Across the Obelisk is, like... Because that's what I'm going to compare it to. Because Across the Obelisk is another four-player co-op, you know, deck builder. But that's more of, like, a... Darkest Dungeon, Slay the Spire type thing. This, although at its core is a little bit more simplistic, there's, I I don't know. This is such a unique experience. Also, they are destroying us. So I don't know. Um, mocking verse, steal opponent, opposing bands, active song section, minus three other band. Oh my, they're destroying us here. They're destroying us. Holy cow, they took all of our hype. Uh, okay, we're going to... I don't have a song. Okay, hurl insults. Starting... Oh, I don't have a song. Does anyone have a song? Nice. Okay, starting taps. I gave someone energy. Oh, I think they gave it to me. Uh, sick beats. Quick beats. Bummer performance. That would still be... Oh, that just takes up a lot of... 
Oh, is Hurt Feelings just in my deck until I, or in my hand until I play it? Yeah, these guys are, these guys are destroying us. Yeah, I think I keep just drawing it. Oh my gosh, minus two to other bands play. Holy cow. Yeah, we have some of the shields, but holy cow, these guys are very aggressive. Uh, what am I gonna play? I think I'm going to play this to give someone more energy. These guys are demolishing us. We're gonna lose here. Oh, there's also a chat. Okay, uh, starting taps. Um, oh, I have a spicy verse, and now that's gonna be upgraded. That's all I can do. Oh, someone played bouncer. Moves uh, one other band cruise card on play, plus one random band made shield on play. Hmm, okay. So yeah, well obviously like someone is the support here. I don't know who, I don't know who. This is very interesting. We're gonna lose, but I hope we don't lose all of our morale. <laughs> I don't want to lose all my morale. Oh, someone gave me mana. Um, I have a loud beat. I can play that. That's all I can do though. Have you watched Marvel's What If? I have not. If it's a superhero thing, I gotta say I'm not like the craziest into a superhero stuff. Um, I'll watch the occasional thing, like the new Suicide Squad was pretty lit. Um, but I can't say I have uh, watched that too, too much. Oh my, yeah, they're demolishing us. They're filling up my hand with these cards that I'm not wanting to play. What about Star Wars Visions? That's like the Star Wars anime thing, right? Oh, we lost. I have not seen that. Um, but I'm interested in it. Also, are we about to lose? Oh, we lost. <laughs> hey, we leveled up though. So I unlock new cards. These will now appear in future runs. So for the drummer, plus one random bandmates energy on play, plus one random enter. Ran oh, so it's okay. So I play it and two of my people get one random and then we have a rolling bridge. Thanks for checking out Tier Mode. In the full game, you can look forward to unlocking all sorts of cosmetic items like outfits, helmets, instruments, and more uh, to really make your band stand up from the rest. From now on, though, why not try switching your instrument up and playing again? Each instrument deck has its own cards, and there's a lot of new ones you can unlock by leveling up. That is, uh, that is really freaking cool. Gonna watch Star Wars Visions? Yeah, that I've, I've heard people talking really, really awesome about that. I've, I've heard people talk really good about that. Oh, you can customize your character here. That's, uh... That's pretty, that's pretty sick. Hair, oh, okay. Yeah, no, so this is, this is something that I definitely, definitely am going to, uh, so yeah, I, actually, yeah, let's see here. Guitar deck, what is the guitar good at? Echo of the Shred to your draw pile. What is Echo of the Shred? What does that do? I don't, I don't know what Echo of the Shred is. Um, ooh, what are these? Plus two bleeding edge drift to your draw pile. You draw two out of eight random draw pile cards on play. Dedicated fans, you have your crew or whatever. You have your bass or base, whatever. Base deck, what is base about? Is it card draw? Cause yeah, they're all gonna have different things. The keyboard deck. So it's kind of hard to tell what they're all specifically good at. I'm sure, you know, as you play more and stuff like that, um, it'll kind of be easy to figure out. But I, I'm very interested, I'm very interested to check this game out when it officially comes out. This definitely piqued my interest. I now have a slightly better idea of what Battle Bands is and stuff like that. So uh, for all of you guys watching this after the fact, I really hope you guys enjoyed this little sneak peek demo of Battle Bands. Uh, you know, make sure you guys subscribe, ring that bell, all the big boy YouTubers say, uh, to be notified when we have finally covered Battle Bands when it comes out. Uh, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching.